stay out of my way. What are you doing? Warning you, keep back. Come on, think this through. Yeah, do something. Shut up, shut up. Tell us, Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? Tro, they're called Trodon Pectinodon. They were meant to be euthanized, but- What, you let them out? No, no, I kept them in quarantine for study. They, I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain. You knew about those damn creatures all along. While we were out there, exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pilot- Billy, wait. We were nearly killed by one of our own men. Probably bitten by one of those things, just like Decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar's dead! All because of your dinosaurs, all because of you! Oscar doesn't want this. He died helping us all survive. He wouldn't want her dead. Had he known, though! Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner Ah, I... shut it. Injun is the enemy here. They spoiled the island. They made these monsters. You can't make her pay for all that Injun has done. Maybe. Put down the knife. We need to work together, all of us. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! It's... it's m my fault. There. That wasn't so difficult, was it? Your friends may have saved you here. At least I got the truth out of you. You want her alive? You got her. <sighs> you just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, everyone make themselves useful. I've got to tend to decaf. Look, we can't stay here long. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful. A way out, even. Okay. We'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed? A flare kit. This might come in handy. I don't want to get stuck in a vent with a dinosaur. Besides, there's blood everywhere. Ow! Hot! Maybe we should get going. Are you sure? Yeah, if you're ready, Billy. Did you find something? No. Nothing. Is everyone ready? What about decaf? I took care of that. It looked like you took something off him. And if he has something that will help us... I didn't find anything. I took his dog tags. Insurance doesn't pay out to his family unless his dog tags are returned. Satisfied? Right. Sorry for pushing. Should we bring him with us? Why bother? He's already buried. Look, I know where his body is. We're not equipped to transport it. Hopefully, we can retrieve his remains when this is all over. All right, listen up. Everything that just happened, bygones, understand? Doc, tell me again about the phones. Um, according to the terminal in my lab, the marine exhibit phones are still connected to the transceiver. The visitor center phones Too are- Too far away, okay? And we can get to the exhibit through the tunnels? They're all interconnected. I think I can still find- The answer is yes. Thank you. All right, we all have the same priorities here now. We get to this marine exhibit and find the phone. We get another chopper in the air to lift us out from there. How are we gonna get there? Trodon could still be out there. We aren't equipped to treat any more bites. We have to- Shh. I will not be shushed. The door. Oh no.
They're coming through the vent! They're going past the door. Jerry, <laughs> get that crate open! I'm on it. I need something to break the lock. We'll find that something! I know, I know! No. Which way, Laura? I don't know where we are anymore. We, we need to head towards the north. It's a junction box. Which lines go towards... Staff Village is inland. That's the wrong way. Mon people, they're still after us. The desalination plant. That's where the marine exhibit is. Look, follow the red conduit. Keep moving! Don't look back, it always slows you down! Wait! The conduit's gone! Don't stop! Wait! Those are water mains! No! Follow them! Which way, Laura? I don't know, Jerry. We must be 40 feet underground. I have no idea where we are. Well, we can't just sit around with our thumbs up our butts. I, I don't hear them anymore. 
Their behavior seemed territorial. Maybe we're far enough away from the nest that they gave up on us. We might have outpaced them, but we're not exactly in a secure location. Which way are we heading, Doc? Um... Look over here. Can you read these? Maybe. If I can find... Yes. Yes. Okay. We're at a four-way intersection. There are only four such intersections on the plan. Let me just cross-reference these detail labels. Okay. We just have to figure out which intersection we're at. Look around the corridors for any distinguishing features. I'll see if I can eliminate possibilities. Maybe I can help with the plans. They look pretty simple. I don't have enough to go on here. I need details, landmarks, something unique. There's a big yellow pipe going down the left wall. It crosses over the ceiling part way down the corridor. It looks like the corridor ends in a T intersection. There's a ladder on the right, and on the far wall at the end. I see some sort of water tanks at the end of the hall. There's a set of water tanks part way down the corridor on the right. This tunnel only goes down a few dozen yards to a dead end. I see one ladder at the end of the hallway. I'll circle this one as a candidate. Okay, Laura. I hope you're right. I'm just gonna cross this one off. Okay, I hope you're right. There are these two big electrical boxes of some kind on the right. There's a big yellow pipe that goes down a bit on the left and then crosses over to the other side. I see two ladders along the left of the tunnel. The tunnel goes straight and then turns to the right. There's a ladder on the right, and on the far wall at the end. It looks like the corridor ends in a T intersection. Could be here. I guess they all kind of look the same. Look down the corridors. I need to know what you see. Describe it in as much detail as you can.
There's a set of water tanks part way down the corridor on the right. This tunnel only goes down a few dozen yards to a dead end. Okay, these symbols are access ladders. These thick lines represent large pipes. The circles are water tanks. And these boxes with the crosses in them are power relays or transformers. Does that help any? Not on its own, but I can tell that the different intersections seem to have some small inconsistencies in layout. We could be here. I guess they all kind of look the same. Jess? Where are you? I'm at the workbench. Oh, sorry. It's so dark. Just don't wander off, okay? Wander off into the dinosaur-infested pitch-black tunnels? I think I can resist that temptation. It looks like the corridor ends in a T intersection. I see some sort of water tanks at the end of the hall. down the corridors. I need to know what you see. Describe it in as much detail as you can. What do you think, Jess? Probably not this one? Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think it's this one. How can you keep them all straight? Okay, everyone, I think I've got it. Are you sure? I'm positive. We must be here. It's the only one that completely matches our surroundings. Okay, here we are. The desalination plant is here. We're not that far. No, we follow this route here. We follow any water mains at junctions in the direction of convergence. Even still, there's barely any turns. Look, just memorize this route. What is it? Oh God, Jess! Oh, what have I done? Jerry. I just left her down there. I have to go find her. What? Back down there? 
with those monsters? No, Jerry. She needs you safe. Jess is a strong and resourceful girl. She's doing like we are doing. Surviving. You can't know that. I won't leave her to those animals. Jerry, look at me. If we go back down there, we won't make it to the bottom of that ladder. The others escaped down the tunnel we were gonna follow. We know where they're going. The marine exhibit. That's where Laura would take her. And Yoder is with them. Oh, God. If we're going to join them again, that is where we have to go. The quickest way we can. You're right. We should be able to make better time over land. Can you get us there? Uh, it must be to the north, near the outlet of the river. A big river? With many falls? Yeah, the big river. Okay, good. That's something. Let me get my bearings, and we'll figure out how to get there. Por el amor de Dios. Do you know where we are? Let me think. It's been so long. This is my first time back on the island in nearly 12 years. Engine has changed it so much. I don't know what your relationship to InGen or this island is, but we have little time. You think I do not know this, Jerry? I'm doing my best to help you and your daughter. You're right. I'm sorry. I grew up here, you know? Below those trees. My people were fishermen. We would make our homes near the water during the fishing season. I love the water. I would swim in the ocean. So far. That's why my father called me Nima. I could go anywhere, run in the jungle, climb the trees, these monsters. There was never anything like them on this island before. It was all very peaceful before Injun bought the island from Costa Rica. The island is so different now. I know the island. It's part of me. But... When Injun came to the island, important men from Costa Rica came and asked my father to go back with them. They wanted my father to make a good impression, so that Costa Rica could ask Injun for a good deal of money for our island. When he was in Costa Rica, he was asked to cut his hair and wear a suit, so that he wouldn't seem simple to the Injun people. I felt as I feel now. My father was different. I knew him, but some part of him had been lost. My father was an Awa, a spiritual healer. He sang for Sibo, who created the Earth. He was very important to our tribe. But after we left the island, he would not keep up the old traditions. He was always unhappy. Before Injin, when my father and I would go to the ocean to fish, when I would swim in the ocean, my father would say, Nima! Little fish! Little fish, do not swim so far. I cannot catch you so far out. When Injun came to move us to Costa Rica, I became very angry with my father. Whatever he would tell me to do, I would refuse. But he would never be angry with me. He would say that I am a fish who would never eat the fisher's bait. He was right. To me, everything had a string attached. He would always remind me of my stubbornness. I think I believe that's how I must always be. You know, no ties, no temptation. But then I had Atlanta, my mariquita. She is almost of an age where she will outgrow my protection. Young girls on the streets in my neighborhood, they get snatched up by local cartels, run drugs. Or worse, some just disappear. Now there is no choice. Everything I do, I do for her. Now I am the fisher, and at the same time, I have come to a way in my life where I must always chase the bait. I want for Atlanta to be free. I want for her to have opportunities that I didn't have. I just hope I can be there for her the way my father was there for me. She can be stubborn like her mother used to be and refuse the fisher's bait. I think I know now it's a good way to be. I think that my father believed that too. Nima, look, I... What is it? Nima, I want to trust you.
Help me get Jess off this island, and I will do whatever I can to help you and your daughter. I could not hold you to that, Jerry. If we don't get off this island, you might not have to. Please. All right, Jerry. Enough talk. You know where we are? I have a good idea. It's a difficult hike. Do you feel rested? Hungry. A little thirsty, but I, I just want to get to Jess. Good. Dilophosaurus? Hello? That was actually the call of a whooping swan. Dinosaurs shared many features with modern-day birds. For instance, we now know that many theropod dinosaurs from the Jurassic period's vocal organs are just like modern birds. We are arriving at the fourth of seven lookouts along the tour. Your Jurassic Park tour vehicle will stop for five minutes to let you stretch your legs and take photographs of our animals. Next stop, the Jurassic Park Marine Facility and Aquarium. 